What do you get when you combine the powers of a pickup truck, the speed of a sports car, and the design from a sci-fi movie? The answer is Cybertruck, Tesla's most latest and daring creation. The Cybertruck's not just a vehicle, but it's a statement. It's a vision of the future where EVs are not only eco-friendly, but sleek, rugged, and unusual. Damage to it. We smashed the refrigerator. Oops. You gotta watch the video. Huh. Um, you know, there's a lot of stuff that I thought, okay, you know, the headlights are, they work fine, but they're a very, very small opening on the, down on the bumper. And I thought, okay, if what happens when they get full of snow? Like you're, it's the ultimate non socko treatment of headlights. Um, they're just a bunch of things, the questions that I have, but I really did go into this whole experiment, kind of hating the Cybertruck, hating everything it stood for, kind of hating the way it looked, the idea of all the excess. And I came away from it like loving Respecting it. Respecting it. No, loving it. Loving right? it. More than that. What yeah. did you find lovable? The, the fact that it does so many things so well without being excessive. There's still that like Lotus-like obsession with simplicity and lightweight that mm. went into even this thing. Like the fucking aero wheel covers. Like, so it's got these, these hubcaps on them. They're rubber. The reason they're rubber is because they tried to make them out of plastic and the wheel would flex and the plastic would go flying off. So they made them out of rubber. But that means you can't curb the wheel. And they're removable, Wait, by the way. Wait, why is this problem something that has never arisen before? What is These things are rare. The, the, it's very rare that a product comes along that is uh, seemingly impossible, uh, that, that people said was impossible, that experts said was impossible. And this is one of those times. We have, a, we have a car here that experts said was impossible, that experts said would never be made, that uh, it, it, it really is the most, I think, it's, I think it's our best product, I think it's the most unique thing on the road, and finally, the future will look like the future. Cybertruck is Tesla's most polarizing and innovative product yet. It's a vehicle that defies convention with its futuristic design, a powerful performance, and a durable structure. It's a vehicle that sparks debate, with some people loving it and others hating it. But what is the truth behind Cybertruck and why should you care about it? In this video, automotive journalist Jason Kramitzer shares a beautiful story about how he fell in love with the Cybertruck, and he unveiled some secrets, benefits, and risks with the truck and why it could be the best thing that's ever happened to Tesla and its investors. If you're a Tesla fanboy, this is one to watch. Reason he decides to reinvent the wheel or reinvent the pickup truck, right? In this case. So they they put it on stage. Despite the fiasco, they the order started pouring in. Now, I don't I'm sure it was originally intended for intended for production, but I don't think anyone would have guessed that they would have a million orders for this truck. That's a million people. What were they them. secured with? They were hundred dollars. Mm. Refundable? Refundable. But mm -hmm. how many people could you get to give you a hundred hundred bucks? refundable or not a lot fewer than that right that's my point like a million people plunked down 100 bucks which is by the way a nice loan to tesla for the development of this of yes this yes that's always the yeah. mechanism that these so, startups use yeah so a long story short everyone goes to work on this truck they spend two years they're engineering the truck based on that uh the, the truck on the show stands they're not really allowed to change anything about the way it looks uh which presented huge engineering challenges both in terms of the uh stainless steel uh, uh, construction, this quote unquote exoskeleton structure that had never been done before in a car, um, but also just aerodynamics, right? Which are the most important thing on an electric vehicle. So they get done and Elon takes the first drivable prototype home and decrees it too big. Can't fit in the driveway, can't fit in the garage, whatever. It was just too big. Um, so they had to throw it out and start over. I mean, it's never fully thrown out, but they had to just take the same brief and put it in a much smaller package. How and much that, did they scale it down? Overall, 5%. Um, and I don't have the numbers in front of me, but I think like width was 3%, length was 7%. It averages out to be about five overall, but they didn't just select all and times 0 0.095, right? Um, because they had packaging constraints and they had other engineering constraints and like the wheels aren't gonna change size and the motors aren't gonna change size and the interior can't shrink. So they basically started over. Um, in the ever-evolving landscape of EVs, Tesla's Cybertruck has emerged as a polarizing figure, drawing both fervent admirers and skeptical critics. It's been hailed as a revolutionary pickup designed by some, while others see it as a testament to Musk's penchant for style over substance. 
the bears who once doubted Tesla's Cybertruck plans and the magnificence of the vehicle are now starting to understand the uniqueness of it. In fact, details about the Cybertruck are continuing to emerge, and it becomes increasingly apparent that beneath the exterior of angles and all this tech lies a technological marvel that challenges convention of traditional pickup trucks. Hey guys, welcome back to Tesla Tomorrow. In today's video, we're going to look at today's saturated markets. It can be difficult for new products to stand out from the crowd and grab consumer attention. Since there are so many similar offerings from various brands, it's becoming increasingly important for companies to introduce truly unique products that break the mold. Therefore, having a unique product simplifies the marketing process and gives the brand a major competitive edge. This is the Cybertruck strategy. Tesla's brand new Cybertruck is the perfect example of how power of a unique design can actually be wielded by the user, and in no time we're going to see how well it plays out for Tesla's overall valuation as a company. So why is the Cybertruck a big deal? And why is there so much hype around the truck? Well, you're about to find out. Before we carry on though, if you like this type of content, hit that like button, subscribe and turn on post notifications to keep up to date on everything going on with Tesla. Tesla's commitment to innovation is evident in every facet of the Cybertruck, from its exoskeleton design to its spacious interior. This electric powerhouse showcases Tesla's unrelenting pursuit for pushing boundaries. The Cybertruck isn't just about broad, but it's a technological marvel too. With its FSD technology at its core, the Cybertruck promises a level of autonomy that could revolutionize the way we think about transportation. No doubt the journey to bring Cybertruck to market hasn't been without its challenges. From supply chain issues to production delays, Tesla has had to navigate a complex landscape, but the company's resilience and determination has all kept the Cybertruck on track. This is a vehicle that is designed to disrupt the pickup truck market. In fact, Tesla's entry into the pickup truck market is expected to ignite a significant shift towards electrification, meaning that Cybertruck's success could catalyze other automakers to accelerate their EVs and bring them out in due course. One of the key advantages of a unique product like this is its ability to stand out from the competition in a competitive and crowded market, where consumers are bombarded with similar offerings and the Cybertruck's distinctive design sets it apart instantly. Its angular, futuristic appearance challenges the traditional norms of what a pickup truck should look like. It's eye-catching and memorable, and this differentiation provides Tesla with an edge, as potential consumers are more likely to remember a product that breaks the mold. And so what we have here is, is something that is a better truck than a truck, while also being a better sports car than a sports car. In the same package. A unique product like the Cybertruck provides marketers with a compelling story to tell. Marketers can focus their efforts on highlighting its distinctive qualities rather than engaging in direct competition and comparison with competitors. And now let's explore the revenue part of the Cybertruck. And to every Tesla investor watching right now, this is one that you gotta pay attention to. Although mass production has taken longer than expected, Musk is clearly pleased to present what he's called the company's best product ever. Following on from the Cybertruck's launch, Tesla has announced plans to bring in the vehicle with a competitive pricing, ranging from $60,990 for the rear-wheel drive to $999,990 for the high-end Cyberbeast. The all-wheel drive model, on the other hand, is starting at $79,990. If the Cybertruck has an immediate impact on Tesla's business, it's likely to be creating a halo effect for the brand as a whole. If Tesla has lost some of its recent brand buzz in recent years, well, it's likely to be regained with the Cybertruck's launch. Tesla has the capacity to produce at least 125,000 of these at its Austin Gigafactory, and even Musk says that the company aims to produce 250,000 starting the year 2025 and continue that each year moving forward. Already, there are over a million reservations for the Cybertruck even before launch, and that means that Tesla can sell up to 1 million Cybertrucks on an average of $80,000 per truck, approximately $80 million in revenue from just this one vehicle. Remember that there's also FSD, superchargers, batteries, and other Tesla models too. This means that Tesla is about to enter the money printing era. However, while the Cybertruck could rejuvenate that Tesla brand, it is also important to note that its impact on the company's financials is likely to be modest in the near term, but we'll see how that goes. As a stock, Tesla has maintained its premium in spite of the recent challenges, and the Cybertruck is likely to help protect its valuation, even if it isn't expected to improve the bottom line for at least a year. 
Overall though, we expect the Cybertruck to be a game changer. Even car expert and Tesla bull Sandy Monroe can't help but tear down the vehicle and evaluate its groundbreaking technology. He also predicts that in 12 months, Tesla will be at least 250,000 to 500,000 Cybertrucks per year run rate depending on the number of shifts. A unique Cybertruck design sparks curiosity and excitement, and it leads to buzz with this unconventional design that sparked intense debate and discussion among consumers, the media, and even industry experts. The heightened interest has created a snowball effect, generating significant anticipation and pre-orders for the vehicle. Tesla can therefore leverage this buzz to create an effective market-dominating strategy which will push its valuation to unbelievable levels. What do you think about the Cybertruck? Let us know down below, and if you want to know more about what Tesla's been up to over the last few days, go ahead and click on this next video on your screen. See you there!